what is going on youtube yes you guys see it correct man it is like raining outside i'm probably about to do something super crazy shout out to the homie jay on twos man i gotta get a new tire slapped on mama's bike so we're about to drop this off over at the shop real quick and uh he is helping me he's running the tire and a few other goodies that i'm not gonna mention right now but you guys will see man i'm excited to see dominica's reaction we're changing a few things up on this bike gonna make it a little bit quicker and yeah man so stay tuned we about to be out on the road in just a second and uh talk to y'all in a minute all right guys we have made it out on the road baby and uh yeah i'm on my girlfriend's 2007 gsxr 600 y'all i'm sitting here editing this video dom is about to kill me i am on my fiance's 2007 gsxr 600 girl don't kill me watching this video <laughs> she gonna be like oh you got a girlfriend now huh like I said, it has been raining literally all week here. I think we snuck out one time on these bikes this week. But other than that, guys, it has been raining. And we literally just went and shot and got some ice cream and headed on back to the crib that day that we get jump out. That's why a video, didn't, uh, video wasn't made out of it. But yeah, guys, we're taking the bike over to the shop. We've had this tire sitting in the basement since the beginning of the season and just been so busy enjoying the bikes that we haven't had time to really take it over there but i'm making time today the bike is filthy so i didn't really care if it got wet or not because i knew that uh i knew that the bike was dirty and that i'd be giving it a wash anyway so we'll probably wash the bike later on a day taking it over to manual motorcycles here in akron ohio super cool always squeezes us in and uh and yeah man trying to be extra careful of course man the ground is like super duper duper wet and this front tire i've never been a fan on i think it's a never been a fan of i think it's a Metzler, and uh i don't know it's just not giving me the most confidence for some reason it hasn't since we've gotten this bike and uh i don't know it's time so we're matching it up with the back the back had a brand new uh Michelin Commander, uh, not Michelin Commander, that's on my Harley. A Michelin Pilot on the back was brand new on it when we got it. So just matching it up, put a brand new Michelin Pilot on the front. And it should handle a lot better. Um, I don't know, man. Excited. Yeah, excited. We also doing a little something else. I might as well tell y'all. So what's going on, guys? This video is sponsored by, yes, me, Devin Clark. Guys, I want to thank you guys for tuning into this video. But I also want to make a quick announcement. If you don't know, I am a youth inspirational speaker so if you have a school or event or organization that you would love for me to come speak to i would love the opportunity to do so so go visit my website at devinclarkinspires.com go watch one of my videos and if you have an event that you are interested in me coming to speak to i would love the opportunity to do so back to the video peace we are changing the sprockets on this bike so currently the stock sprockets are on here from 2007 we're putting uh, new Vortex sprockets on here. We're gonna keep the rear size the same. But we are going to switch out the front to one tooth, um, one tooth smaller. So it's gonna make this bike accelerate a little bit quicker, man, and just make it a little bit more funner. It's already super fun, but you know, now my mom really gonna be going in on it, man. She gonna be going crazy because she's getting confident gassing it real hard in first gear. Um, so it's gonna be super dope, you know. It's gonna be super dope because now this bike gonna accelerate that much quicker, you know. She gonna think she on a 750 or 1000 or something, you know. So we about to have some fun. We've been having a fun summer, y'all. We have been enjoying these bikes all summer. You guys have been there with us for majority of the summer, man. Kicking it with us through the vlogs. It's funny, man. Riding a 600 versus the 1000. Something I always notice on this bike, and the, the front tooth will change things quite a bit, but you know, when you gas it hard on a 1000, you know, a lot of times if it's wet like this, of course the tire gonna spin and it's gonna go kind of crazy. Whereas on this bike, you know, it doesn't have like a crazy amount of pep in its step in lower RPMs. Once you get higher in the RPMs, man, this thing be floating, but in lower RPMs, it don't be going too crazy, which is cool. <laughs> tire is gonna feel so good y'all so excited to have that on here 
it should lean a lot better like this front tire it just feels like it sort of restricts uh restricts the motorcycle a little bit doesn't feel like it uh it handles the way it should like my 1000 man that bad boy feel like a dream in the corners and that's how really this should feel all right guys we're about halfway there man and so far so good we're just taking it super easy luckily it's not raining right now it's just it's been raining like i said all morning and uh super duper wet crazy thing it was raining probably about a half an hour ago and it must have just stopped at me man but i i was going through it a little bit this week man so i was talking about it a little bit on my instagram story but i'm trying to buy a uh another investment property right so i'm trying to buy the investment property but i'm also <laughs> i'm not also guys i'm playing but you know i have a bad habit of looking at cars looking at motorcycles on facebook marketplace and uh I happen to see a 2007 GSXR 1000, orange and black, and uh, it only had like 5,000 miles on it, guys. I was really contemplating if I wanted to grab it or not. Um, <laughs> I'm not gonna grab it, guys. I was thinking about selling mine and uh, and getting that. I wouldn't keep mine. Um, but then I hopped on mine a couple nights ago, and I was like, man, I'm crazy. I'm not selling this bike. Not right now. Eventually, I do want a new one. Eventually, I'm going to get a, uh, a 2017 um, or newer Jixxon 1000. Eventually. I'm trying to let my insurance come down a little bit. On mine, the insurance is like 400 for the year. On one of those, it will be about 1000 for the year. Which isn't too crazy. Not too bad. Um, but I got a couple other things in my life right now that's a little bit more important than getting a new Jixxon 1000. And at the end of the day, mine is still running good, man. Mine really gives me no problems. It's a great motorcycle. I'm not one of those people that looks at materialistic objects, though. Um, like some people, like some people, are like man, you should never sell that bike. You should always, you know, just keep it, and you know, like it's cool and everything. But at the end of the day. Looking at that state trooper over there, making sure he had no idea. I'm like, bro, I just gave it a tiny bit of gas and it's raining outside. Your boy can't even do nothing crazy. Um, but yeah, I'm not one of them dudes who I don't feel like I gotta keep, you know, something forever. Like I don't still have my first car. Yes, it was a great car, but hey, you you know, you enjoy something while you have it and then get rid of it, get something else, enjoy that. this highway though <laughs> yeah shout out to the homie jay on twos man if y'all not subscribed to his channel it's on the screen right now so look at the screen jay on twos and uh channel growing super fast man he got one video it's creeping up on a thousand views i think he's just about to hit i think 300 subscribers so man let's get him to a thousand subscribers y'all let's get him to a thousand subscribers i know that he's in the talks of getting another bike sooner or later probably gonna be coming uh probably gonna be coming at the beginning of next season but you'll have to go subscribe to his channel to check out everything he got going on man but just a good dude man of god as well and uh you know it's cool to be surrounded around cool people man y'all know me man i gotta hang around people who are going up and the homie jay is going up man majority of the trip man we're almost there like i said i'm just so excited 
and then Dom's gonna reveal something else that she's doing to this bike that we're also getting done today. But yeah, she's excited, I'm excited, man. And it's just, it's time, man. I was ready for this new front tire. It should handle a lot better than it does currently. Um, I don't know, it just feels like when you throw this bike into a corner, it just has a little hesitation. I'm thinking it's from that front tire, whereas the back tire is a Michelin. I got Michelin on my Harley, and man, that bad boy handled like a dream. Like you toss it into a corner and it's dipping. But this, I don't know, I just feel like it, uh, it isn't the same, so. Super sight. This next week, the forecast is actually looking really, really good, so hopefully I'll be putting out a few videos this next week, man. And super excited. Uh, me, my dad, Angelo, and Jay on Twos is actually supposed to kick it with us as well. We're supposed to be going to Maryland next weekend for the XDA uh, race. You know, and it's going to be legendary, man. It's going to be one of the biggest ones of the year on the West Coast, I mean, on the East Coast. This XDA at uh, Maryland International Raceway, so looking forward to that, man. If you're going to be up there, make sure you say what's up to your boy. We'll be up there all Saturday. We'll be coming home on Sunday because got to go back to work on Monday. But if you up there next Saturday, man, make sure you say what's up. All right, guys, we are pulling up at Manual Motorcycles, man. Again, shout out to uh, shout out to the owner. I called this morning and just was like, hey, can I bring this by and pick it up by the end of the day? And he said, no problem at all, man. Bring it by and I'll take care of you. So appreciate that. We hate leaving our bikes, guys, especially over the summer when the weather is nice. We like to ride them. So super dope of him to be able to knock this out for us. And, uh, and yeah, man, so I'm about to run in here, give him the stuff, give him the tires and other little stuff we doing and go from there. All right, guys, so I'm leaving manual motorcycles, man. My mom's bike is complete. And uh, we got that new tire put on, man. And I'm not going to say too much. I'm going to let her reveal everything else she did. We did do a change of the front and rear sprocket. We went down a tooth on the front sprocket. So, of course, excited to feel that. Won't really get to test it out right now because, of course, it's still wet outside. But um, she looks good. And, man, shout out to Manual Motorcycles again for taking care of me, getting me in and out on the same day. Man, that's always super duper dope. So we're about to... Uh, I'm about to take her on up out of here, man, and uh, and head on back to the Cribio. Get this bad boy cleaned up sometime today. Get it cleaned up. All right, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. I know I like barely have made it out this parking lot, but. It seems just to be like when I give it gas, it's revving a little different, but but that's because of that sprocket. So that is so dope. And not even gonna lie, y'all, already I notice a difference with this tire first off. That, uh, and that sprocket, y'all. Man, I wish the weather was nice. But it's all good because it will be a. Uh, it will be tomorrow, and this will give us the day to get it cleaned up. And yeah, man, we back though. I just want to show y'all we picked it up, man, and uh, it ain't gonna be too much going on on this ride home. Just taking it easy and. Uh, just want to get home safe, but I'll see y'all in a second when I pull up at the crib. What's going on, bro? Dude was just staring at me, so I'm like, what's up, man? What up? This bike be sounding crazy, y'all. Hey, little word from the wise. You know, if you've never ridden in the rain before and you don't like, you're not like a super experienced rider, even if you are, you know what I'm saying? Of course, take it easy 
in these wet conditions, man, because you could get messed up on these bikes, y'all, as you are well aware. So I know I give it a little gas, but trust me, I'm paying a lot of attention to what I'm doing. Kind of dry right here, though. It's been dried up. But yeah, man, take your time. Be easy. You know what I'm saying? If you get if you out riding and you get caught in the rain, man, just slow down. Take your time. Don't freak out. Don't panic. Just take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Ain't no rush. You'll get home. Just take your time, baby. But anyways, guys, I'll see y'all in a minute at the crib. All right, y'all. Your boy just got home, man. Just hopped off of this wonderful freaking motorcycle, man. The 2007 GSXR 600. As you see, we got the new Michelin on the front of here. Guys, it feels literally amazing. I just like came home. It was like a 10, 15 minute ride, but literally it feels so amazing. So, so happy to have it done. Um, the bike is running good. We also went down a tooth on the front sprocket and I can tell, man, it accelerates a lot quicker. And of course, y'all saw the uh, weather conditions. We're still super wet on the road, so I couldn't go crazy, but you know, I'm excited to get out there tomorrow. Um, Dom gonna be on it, man. And she uh, she already be gassing it in first, y'all. So now she wanna be going crazy next to the 01 Jixxer. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna thank you guys again for tuning in to another video, man. Continuing to rock with your boy, man. We have had a legendary summer thus far. It's crazy, but we are already halfway through our summer, man. So we gotta make the second half even more legendary than the first half, man. So again, thank you all again for tuning in to this video. Subscribe if you have not already. Follow me on Instagram at the real Devin Clark. And always remember, when God is in it, man, there is no limit. We will see y'all in the next video. Peace.